Let's make the double crochet post ribbing stitch. Start with an even number of chains. Starting in the fourth chain from the hook, one, two, three, four, yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two loops, pull through two more loops to make a double crochet. Work one double crochet into each chain to the end of the row. At the end of the row, chain two and turn your work. Beginning in the second post, the turning chain counts as a stitch. This would be the first post. Let's begin in the second one. Yarn over, insert your hook from front to back and back to the front, popping that post forward yarning over, pulling up a loop, pulling through two, pulling through two. Now let's work a back post double crochet by inserting our hook from the back to the front and back to the back, yarn over, pull up a loop, finish your double crochet. Let's alternate popping one post forward, one post to the back. After you've finished working all the post stitches, work one regular uh, double crochet around the space that the turning chains made. Chain two and turn. Reach your hook down Let's work another front post double crochet, matching up the direction of the post from the row below. Make sure your last stitch is always around the space that the turning chains made. Chain two and turn and repeat your work. A ribbing stitch is great for 
um, around the brim of hats, lots of different uses for ribbing around the edge of blankets we love to use them for. So just make sure you're matching up those post stitches and you're on your way.